Ooh. Glad I didn't go short sleeves tonight. I did think about it. It's actually pretty chilly. Might just be because we're by the river. Good evening. Wheelers at large. We're out again. Oh, duck. Oh, I'm eating flies. Flag's not up. I don't know which way the wind's going. It's usually a flag. So you know this area quite well then? Yeah. Yeah. So you've got both. All the bikes. You got all the bikes. You can never have enough bikes. No. No. Ross has got a few as well, haven't you? Four. Yeah. Yeah. We all collect them. Yeah, all back together again. There's always a little bit of a split along there. There's a few little rollers, only tiny. And when you've got a headwind like this and nobody to sit behind, they can take the toll. On your right. I'm coming through the middle. There we go. There she comes. Half wheeling everyone. <laughs> you need to eat some more pies. Do I? <laughs> yeah, I can still feel the headwind. I was New Yorker. Ah, seems a long time ago now. Yeah, it was good. It was really good. And you booked up again. Oh, we have. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, we didn't finish that lighthouse ride. Oh, did you not? No. The, um, there was a car overturned oh, okay. and the police wouldn't let us through. So, yeah, I've got to go back to finish that one. If I needed an excuse. Yeah, that's it, it must have been fake. <laughs> Since getting the road bike and going 52.11 as my top gear, whenever I ride this bike, I seem to be in 46.11 a lot. Even like now. Of course, this isn't really built with road gearing in mind. On the gravel, the gearing is pretty much spot on. So this is Sopley Air Base, RAF Sopley. In the wall, it was a radar station that faced inland. So when the bombers went across the coast, we could then track them inland to see where they were heading. There you go. That's about the only thing I know about it. Other than um, just before it closed and took in the Vietnamese boat people, I went on a donkey ride here. <laughs> Interesting stuff, eh? He always says that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he all, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh dear, we got jokers in tonight. <laughs> First bit of mud. Rather big hole coming up, just here. There we go, over a million pound bridge. Up and over. Nine point six miles in, first puncher. It's a good job these gravel tyres are robust and you know can cope with the road. I told myself to get out. <laughs> yes, I do find it difficult in the evenings to get out and ride, but when I do, it's so worth it. Yeah, I very rarely do, but I say it's quite nice. Yeah, yeah, the effort is worth it. Just going to cross Tuckton Bridge. Yeah, several ways out of town for us. If we're heading uh, east, Hampshire, New Forest, Tuckton Bridge, Christchurch is definitely the way we go the most. The most direct for us anyway. I know! 
know, it's nice to have another lady on well, my... Uh, well, you're a lady as well. Rides, yeah. You're a lady. What a lady, yes. Behave yeah, well, yourself. It's 2024, so... Ha, ha, ha. Oh, okay, I went the wrong way. Hey, whoops, whoopsie, I wasn't sure, <laughs> I was going up the hill. <laughs> Were you? Yeah. What, the Southbourne? Up the hill, yeah. to the top of, uh, yeah, through Southbourne, but we're not going that way, are we? Yeah, yeah I should, shouldn't I? <laughs> <laughs> Oh you well. Just the mic, you, really? Yeah, I know. You don't need to know, really. It's a nice round here, isn't it? Oh, it's lovely. Wow. Very nice. I've been on that river, kayak, and it's worth. Have you? Just really? Yeah, quite the water. How lovely. Down onto the sea front. Down here, it's hard windy. Through the sand, looks like it could be deep in places, but you know, we're on the gravel bikes. Deep sand's a soft landing, let's be honest. I'm glad we're not on the road bikes. Down on the seafront, there's a fair bit of sand. It's been a bit windy, so there's quite a lot been washed up off the beach. I'm enjoying my ride so far, and I haven't haven't got to ride with all men. I've got another lady. She's back there. Very nice to ride with another lady. <laughs> uh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Did we slide too? <laughs> Gave me a toe. <laughs> Sorry. You've got to work harder. <laughs> there was a frost this morning. Yeah. I went through Merrick Park. It's yeah. going to work. In the area where it hadn't been in the sun, it was all white and sparkling. Yeah. We've made it to Beta, and look at that. That is quite a sunset. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Get taken to all the best places. We're at Asda. It's a water stop. It's got dark. And it smells of seaweed. Must be Holes Bay. Bollards. <laughs> oh, that's better. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we found gravel and we definitely found darkness. And we have gravel all the way back to Ringwood now. 
all bar about a mile in the middle. My voice cracked. Oh. <laughs> Wake up. Evening. Once we get on the gravel, this bike just comes alive. Just the pedaling gets easier. It just oh, smooths everything out. Grip on the corners. Light and agile. I mean, it's aluminium. It's not the lightest bike in the world, but somehow Giant have made it feel light and agile. Yeah. Nice bit of night gravel. Yeah, enjoying this. Very nice. It's so worth getting out in the evenings after work. It is a struggle, but really worth it. Very enjoyable. Chasing him over the bridge. Yeah, Ross comes and visits us. Uh, well, visits his family, rides with us. Uh, he's from Devon, as you can see. <laughs> this is nothing for him. No, yeah, you can go that way through the trees. Not sure about in the dark. <laughs> yeah. Mike's back on the front. I was at the front for a while. I didn't stay there for long. more peril at night. <laughs> My legs are starting to fade a little bit. Starting to get a little bit tired. What have we done? 32 miles after a full day at work. <laughs> well I think they've put uh, new gravel down through here but in all honesty it never dries so anything that gets put down here just gets squashed through the mud and uh, never to be seen again, let's say. <clears throat> it doesn't seem too bad at the moment, <laughs> I'll be honest. I've seen it much worse than this. That wasn't too bad through there, though. Was no. Yeah. I, th I was expecting it to be really, really sloppy. Yeah. But it wasn't. It's the last bit of the Castleman Trail to do. And we're back in Ringwood. And that's our first night gravel ride for a long time. Great fun. Had to happen, didn't it? And as if by magic, here we are. Actually, this is against your contract. Well, it's all right, it's in the dark, nobody can see. <laughs> <laughs> so, there you go, can you see me? Well, I can see you because you're right here, both, right in I front can of see me. Both of you. <laughs> if you've watched this far into the video, thank you for watching us. Click the like button and join us for the next one. That was our first night gravel for a long time and it was, it was. brilliant. It was really good fun, wasn't it? <laughs> Did you enjoy it, Ross? Absolutely brilliant. Absolutely loved it. Good, good. See you on the next one. See you on the next one. <laughs>